G'day, I'm Chris. This is Game Chambers, not Tech Chambers like I got wrong last time. And today we are playing once again Age of Sigma Stormground. Now, last time we uh, messed up, I went back and had a look and I made a couple of bad decisions that ended the run that we were in. And now we're back at the beginning again. So back to the gate to the manse. We're going to try and go through this a little quicker because it's back to the very beginning of the game. It's already so Whoa, Did I forget to... No, I do still have my extra units. I didn't remove their gear though, uh, so I can't do any summoning straight away. But let's try and get this done quickly. Common war chest. I want to get that lore cash. Uh, this is actually. I am prepared to do my duty. As duty Come all the way in this way. Still can't summon anything. I forgot to take my gear off to make their prices a bit cheaper, but it's um Freya should be able to pretty much end this solo. First mission back. Okay, so next time next time we're gonna be able to bring the liberators in, so let's do that. Okay. Let's get the uh, can't move the liberators this turn, can we? Move up this way. I'm going to get both the little cash and the war chest, actually. So where did that armor range? Oh, because I because used the protect ability. Yeah. All right. Champions of the free people. Okay. So I don't know if I want that auto protect to be on, but. Can you reach there? You cannot. Liberators, ready to do our duty. Protectors uh, of the Azir. The righteous path is the only. I can't do an additional two oh damage to King. him, so let's just heal up so we don't cop that hit. And I'm gonna actually can I move an attack? I can't. I, I think I've worked out what that little uh percentage number means and why we sometimes take zero damage. So occasionally there'll be a percentage. I think that's the percentage chance of receiving zero damage from attack. Let's see if I can get it to come up again. I will not stray. Liberators. Ready right, to keep the liberator duty. side by side. And we'll get our prosecutor over here to grab this law cash. It's a little bit quicker than the rest of us. Chain gas, a lot of range coming in at, at us this time. Liberators, ready to do our duty. Liberators, so we get the liberators over there. I've, I've got a bad habit of losing my liberators, so I'm going to try and keep them a bit safer. Um, so you've got fortifiers as well. So there's an 81% chance, and I think that means an 81% chance that we don't take any damage from the retaliatory strike. This guy can come in here. We we'll still have our uh, shield wall going, and just those models over that way. Uh, I'm not too worried about them taking that chest if they do, but we should be able to get around there to get it. My commitment is absolute. Okay, so let's fortify because it's going to increase our retaliatory damage, and it's just so. I don't really want to take any damage if I can help it. Uh, yeah, we're just going to play this real safe. I've lost enough units. Of course, I don't want to lose any more runs, so we're going to try and be as safe as possible. Uh, so I'm going to take one damage. And then we're going to take another damage in retali retaliation. Yeah. It's okay. From above. Oh. Ready. Uh, well, maybe bring him around this way. We don't want to go up over the top. To bring Can I move there? Yep. Okay. Sixty-two percent chance of no damage. So I'm pretty sure that is what that means. Heal this back up. Okay, 
so we're not going to be able to get into range this turn, so we're just going to move up here. Will this bring him into melee? No, it won't. Champions of the free peoples. Bring you there, so that I can come in here, throw the spear, and keep our shield wall up. Next turn we can grab that lore cat. Ah, the, the loot first. I'm gonna lose a bottle. No, shouldn't do. Um, actually, we can knock this guy straight back into the wall, which will do one damage. So these two guys, just to be on the safe side, we can fortify. Whoops. Did you do it? Yeah, there we go. That, that was weird. That took a while. So we'll move you over there. Yep, got four items. Cool, now let me keep moving. And challenge won't do anything. Hammer slam. It's not going to hurt him because it doesn't count as the edge of the map. Okay. Well, let's do that. Javelin him and then go in and finish him off. Yeah, melee. First one for our third run down. Okay. Deflect block charge damage. Usable by tanks. Block damage from enemy charge, then remove a stack. Okay, so you get one stack of this for one skill point. Some more Vanguard Hunters. An armored Warhammer. Okay, that's just a standard Warhammer. Great bow shots usable after move. That's quite good. Plus one power. I can only be used by the castigators. Uh, I generally like to use the artillery and increasing their power to do something that artillery does anyway. I don't know if that's worth it. And again, I'm still not sure what this contribute does, but I don't want anything else, so. Oh, we get all three. Okay. There's some more of our, our lore, so we'll just keep collecting that. A few more levels there. Okay, now we get a couple options. Assault class, artillery class are our reward options for these. So they both destroy all enemies. Slightly different um, loadouts. I prefer the enemies on this one because there's no exploding enemies, but I do want to get the artillery unit. So let's go into here. We might as well use the vanguards. Okay, so defense one against charge. It's going to be heal one against charge is going to be better than blocking a single attack on a charge. Now, what are you good running? Auto protect. We want to take that off. So our other option is the deflect to block a charge attack. It'll slow down our our flow a bit, but we're going to give it a go. Um, I've not been having much success keeping things cheap and cheerful, so we'll try that. Now, what did we actually get to keep? It was just the stuff that we had equipped on our units that we selected. But we have kept all our skills. Okay, so all the skills we've gotten from our previous run, we get to keep. Okay, so that's good. So, actually, in that case... I really liked fire support on these guys. In which case I'm going to take deflect off these liberators. So at least we can drop liberators on turn 4 or turn 2 when we've got 4 mana. Then the hunters to give us the range support and then eventually we'll have the prosecutors. Um, did, we weren't allowed to keep the um, that guy I guess. The divine act? Yeah. Looks like we weren't allowed to keep him. Okay. Alright, well, let's go for this artillery class. See if we can make our way back through the. Back through Shayish. We got Law Cash and a War Chest. See if we can get both again. Put a high ground in the middle. A couple of Mermon Banshees and Glaive Wraith Stalkers. What are these ones? I don't recognize these ones. So they ignore armor. What is this marked for death that they do? Oh, 
do more damage with. So, do one damage for each stack of marked for death the unit has. But how does that happen? Charge, apply a rend. Scout, ignore armor. I can't see how they apply this marked for death. We'll find out as we go. Uh, what do we want? Do we want the war chest or do we want the law cash? It's only a common war chest. Uh, we'll go to the war, the war chest. The Lord doesn't super interest me uh, at this stage. Okay, so we're all going to come onto us. We'll be able to bring the Liberator in. How are we going to do this? We don't want to all get blown to hell. So I'm thinking we'll come this way so we don't get surrounded. And we'll summon the Liberator in here. Give us the armor buff. Uh, they are going to ignore our armor though, aren't they? Alright, we'll see what happens. Uh, so this thing's death blow is going to clear everything out, I think. Right, we did get attacked. So it's still going to heal us up one from our armor. Armor end will be annoying, but we don't... They've all got armor piercing anyway. Okay, well this is okay. Liberators, ready to do our duty. I stand ready. Stormcast liberators ready. So I can't do a hammer slam yet. Bring these guys in. What we might Prepare do is we're going to grab this just to get it. Okay. Nothing too exciting there. And then we'll come back to Make here. There's no point buffing the armor of Freya. That's not a bad choice. We only take one damage and we spread another. We get a kill and we spread four damage amongst their team. Knocks Freya back, but that's okay. We, might, we are going to do that. Okay. And then we're going to bring the. Uh, I, don't wanna, I thought I could go into this square here. I uh, don't want to put them out the front because. How much health do they have? They got five health, so it's two. If they go there, yeah, they'll die. They will die wherever I summon them there. Okay. I thought it was going to be able to use this hex. Uh, we're not going to summon our hunters. We need to move out and get them behind us first. And it's alright. Oh, I was expecting to get attacked there. Okay, so now we need to move forward. So we'll move you into there. Now I want you to fortify. And then we'll bring the Vanguard Hunters in. So you're going to cop a hit, which is fine. You don't have armor anyway, you've got the health, and then these two should both die to Freya. Okay. Bleed, hey? That would be an issue. No retaliatory strikes. Why was that? I don't know why I didn't retaliate to any of those. But. Huh. That's a lot of damage. Why am I taking four damage from that? From the bleed. Okay. Alright, so I can move you into there. Shoot that one. 
24% chance of doing zero damage, I guess. Uh, well, that's not good. Even if I fortify, I'm going to take two damage there. Okay. Protect isn't going to help. Let's just knock this one back and get him away from the fight for a second. And then we are going to fortify, because that double bleed is going to hurt. I don't know why he didn't retaliate and kill them last time. Okay, I don't, don't like that turn. That was not very well done. I come back in. Do I retaliate now? Okay. And am I going to retaliate to you? Yep, okay. So that's alright, only you two take. Oh yeah, so you're trying to shoot because you were in that square. Okay. Clean that up. Stay where you are. You're still slowed, so we're just going to try and keep you close. And uh, let's get our prosecutor in. We could have done that last turn, couldn't we? Didn't notice he was ready. Okay, what do we got? Blade guys for Revenants. Which ones are you again? You're the assault ones. With the AoE and the bonus to damage. Okay, Chain Rasps, you are the standard ones. And Blade Guys, Redness, that's more of them. Okay, so we should be able to channel this pretty well. Um, I'm going to stand here and heal up a bit. Where we can. Uh, I don't think they can get to me here. I should have left room for him to come through and put some tra traps out. But I didn't. So I should have made it more room. that one. Frenzy. Okay, so that's a good thing to have on. Okay, that was, yeah, that was from the uh, Fortify. Okay, so what are we going to do here? Can move him up and Hammer Slam will damage them. Freya can move up. Take that. Take that one. So these guys might be able to get around to me. Maybe you up here. And we might as well just... So... Freya's going to do 3 damage to you anyway, so we'll just start whittling down. Are these arranged ones? No, it's just the goon. Okay, we'll just start whittling down the back ones. No, what I should have done was focused on this one. I could have killed it. Yeah, that was my bad. Okay, if I weaken... Weaken that one. It's not going to attack you. If I weaken this one, it's one hit from dying later on. Uh, this one then just needs another tap from someone. And it'll be one hit. Let's see how that goes. Their frenzy's now gone. Okay, so Freya will take one, kill them, and heal that one back. Perfect. Yep, everyone else moves in. Nobody's going to kill us yet. Okay. The righteous path is the only path. What will this do? It's not going to knock anyone into a wall. I thought that would have knocked you back into the wall there. Maybe not. Sigmar's chosen. We're already on full um, Freya. I am going to fortify because you're going to get attacked by at least two, so fortify is essentially a plus two damage buff. Well, it means you'll insta kill this one um, and you'll instantly kill that one, so we don't have to worry about them. Freya's got them now. So this guy can deal two damage to that. Alright, oh, that's not. You don't have the taunt, okay. You got protect. Your other one, fortify. Don't have a gunshot ready, so. You won't kill that, so I don't really want you. Okay, that's okay. We'll bring you up to there. 
bring you up to there. Look to the flanks. And the hunters can come up to there. We Plenty of armor buffs running around, so we should be fine here. We'll take a little bit of BC damage, but no one's in danger. Always forget about that ability, I should have been playing around it. So now everyone's going to die except this one, regardless of who they attack. No, because if they attack you, yeah, she kept everyone next to the Vanguard Hunters. So yeah, okay. They're going Freya. Well, that's the, them done. Yeah, so definitely got to remember to keep these guys on the, behind the front line. So you're still alive. Ready to strike from above. Uh, who can you attack? We are the storm of vengeance. So you can't get. So I can get one damage on you from there. New orders. They'll be able to get. Just name the target. No damage because it's on cooldown. Okay, so we let's just kill this off. We are Moving. Kill that one off. Uh, move this one up. Move this one up. Move this one up. And oh, challenge will kill him. Okay, because we've still got our offensive buff run. Oh, that didn't kill him. Will it force this shot though? Yep, excellent. Ah. Deflected it. That's alright, doesn't matter which one he attacks, he's gonna die. So we'll wrap this fight up neatly. Okay, two missions down. We're on our way back to where we were. Um, hopefully. Plus one health to summon liberators. Do other liberators on spawn? Brotherhood on summon apply fortitude to existing liberate ah, liberators. Fortitude is plus one health permanently. Ooh, okay. Um, I do like having liberators, so that could play into having uh, more than one, but I don't think I got the one at the moment. Just rewards, what's this one? Armored Warhammer, that's the standard Warhammer. And the normal tribute. Uh, I haven't even seen a trap yet, so I'm Hanging on to these skills that give me trap stuff. Alright, Freya's leveled up. Not sure what leveling up does for her. Okay, what are we doing here? Storm Vault. Word Weir Seal. Open the Storm Vault. I haven't done one of these before. Potent treasures sleep within the Storm Vault beneath. Sealed behind Eldritch Locks. Unlatch the locks of the vault so may we may open the way into the inner vault. That's the horsey guys, the explodey guys, two melee guys, and the range guys. Two skull difficulty. Uh, the rewards don't look that exciting. Except we've now got our castigators. So we've got a 3, 4, 5 uh, with our drops. Don't have any gear that we need to equip. Skills, we do have the bleed for the castigators, which is nice, but we want them to be able to cost three. Same as skirmisher, we got these three abilities we can use on the castigators, uh, but we want them to be able to only cost three, so we're not going to use them. Well, let's just quickly jump into it, man. Ignius, what do we have here? It has been too long since we last fought side by side. Indeed, I require your aid, young Freya. This is the entrance to a storm vault, an ancient repository of forbidden relics and lore. Yeah, See those critical. mechanisms? If we activate them, we can gain access to the vaults for ourselves. I guess he's talking about these. The Night Horde have become aware of the storm vault. We must defend it from them. Simply occupy the pressure plates hex with your unit to trigger them. Once it is triggered, it is triggered permanently. Enemies can trigger them for us as well. Okay, so it doesn't matter who triggers these. We just need to trigger all of them. So what do you have, Mr. Igneous? You're a Lord Arcanum. 10 health. That's pretty good. 2 move, 1 armor, 2 damage. Spirit Storm. That's expensive. Big AoE. On enter and exit, deal 2 damage that ignores armor and deal 1 damage per turn. That's pretty good. Chain Lightning, expensive again. 
Grants one stack of chain lightning. The target deals damage that trigger chain lightning and remove all stacks. Okay. And dispel can remove status effects and hexes. And he's also got an etheric slam. Knock back in and summon a fire hazard where they land. Okay, cool. So he knocks them back and sets them on fire. That's pretty cool. Fury of the Storm. Okay, so we want to keep him near our units. And he's a wizard class. Uh, I haven't seen a wizard class before. Okay, so that's uh, something new. Um, let's. Well, let's we want to get this chest as well, so let's claim this one. Okay, so that's triggered. Castigators over here. And Lord Arcanum walk this way. Yes. Alright, next turn we'll get the Liberators. Fine, we want to blow these guys up if we can. Um, we should be able to blow them up with Freya with his attack and damage buff, actually. Yep, perfect. And that's going to knock this guy onto that pressure plate, which is even better. Alright. Thank you for triggering the plates for me. I don't want to be over here, but let's drop a liberator down next to us and we can grab that chest. Try and grab that chest prepared. there. And you guys can move up that way. Moving. And we'll drop this artillery here, because I'm guessing they'll come around that way. Okay. Sam dealt with, so we got we'll send him around that way. So Freya can kill that one off. Move up, support Freya with that shield buff. Move up, capture this one, drop the artillery under here. Make your will known. Uh, Igneous might be in a bit of trouble over here, but he's got plenty of health. Does he have to survive? Yeah, he must survive. And let's get our hunters behind the line to get ready to provide that uh, range support. There you go, banshees, banshees, and. Release us to the hunt. So move these guys up first and I can shoot that banshee unit. Get the kill without taking any damage for us. Freya up to here. Make this land Liberators up to here. Yeah. If we move you here you can provide your damage buff to us all. And you're not gonna move, but you're also gonna to no, you're probably not going to die either, so we'll put that artillery on you and that should finish you off after you've been hit. Okay. No, you will die actually, because you'll get shot by these guys too, won't you? Yeah, I should have dropped the artillery on this one. Okay. Nice. Can't quite get under that, but we can get this unit under there. Uh, you can one shot them, but let's get. Actually, if I do it this way. Yep, then I'll end up next to these guys. The knockback, yep. I uh, don't like. I don't know what happens if we do this. Sigma guides my path. And we'll drop that on this one here. Okay. Uh, we'll grab the law cache next turn and we'll grab the last plate next turn. <laughs> so it just moves them, okay. Oh, and it delays them by a turn. Alright. That's alright. Oh, the artillery gets buffed by the uh, wizard too. Yeah, I definitely need to get a full time wizard in this group. Vanguard hunters. So hunters can go to here. Should have thrown that trap down earlier. Okay, just grab that. Drop the artillery there. All right. Does that end the game straight away, or have we got to kill everyone off? This is a ranged unit, isn't it? Okay. So, do we lose the damage? No, we keep it. 
you in here. And we'll bring you in there to, to give everyone a temporary armor buff. And this, I'll see what happens here. I think it'll move again. Oh, if it fails twice, does it... Okay. Well done. The vault is Definitely have to get one of those wizards that... Oh, Let us venture deeper, young Freya. An AoE buff was really good. We want that full time. Okay. Let's see what we get. We get another prosecutor. I do like the prosecutor. Oh, an armored sword. Usable by pretty much everyone. Deals four damage. Okay, that's nice. For two mana. Okay. Overwatch Overwatch Great Bow Shop. Your skill adds one range and minus one cooldown. Channeling Overwatch on target hexes. Enemy movements inside the area will trigger the trigger the ability. Untrigger fire currently equipped great bow ability. Okay, so it's like a more accurate artillery because you've got a, an area that you're going to bomb it in. But their normal strike only does two damage. The artillery does three. So again, the plus one power. I'm not ready to put on them yet. And a bit more lore to add to our collection. Okay, liberated is leveled up. It's nice. And it looks like here we have a Storm Vault mission. Uh, a slay and two assassinate, slay the target type missions. So next time, that's what we're going to do. I'd say we're going to go into this Storm Vault. Word we is depths. We're going to try and escape the Storm Vault alive. Uh, venture into the inner storm vault, claim the treasures within, but beware. A dark evil sleeps there, long sealed away by Sigma. Lord Arcana and Igneous Smoke Seer will guide you. Uh, it looks like we'll probably pick up Igneous as a divine act, like we did with the last uh, Aquila Lord type guy. So that'll be what we do next time. So thank you for watching. Uh, if you've enjoyed the video, please give me a like. Please subscribe to the channel down the bottom. And we'll see you in the next video.